In the narrative of the Starship Troopers universe, a futuristic human society governed by the United Citizen Federation is depicted. Set in the 23rd century, this society has advanced space exploration and colonization technologies. Established after the collapse of democratically elected governments worldwide, the Federation grants fundamental rights exclusively to those who volunteer for military service. Citizenship is limited to veterans, with civilians unable to vote or easily obtain licenses for childbearing. The Federation not only possesses a formidable military, but also endeavors to expand humanity's reach across numerous planets and moons. However, during this expansion, they encounter arachnids, insect, like alien beings with an advanced empire of their own. The story centers around Johnny Rico, who enlists in the military against his parents' wishes. The narrative unfolds as Johnny and his friends navigate their paths within the military hierarchy. A pivotal moment occurs when an asteroid originating from the arachnid quarantine zone collides with Earth, causing widespread destruction. This event prompts Johnny to commit to the military's cause in fighting the arachnids. The Federation, using the attack as justification, declares war on the arachnids, mobilizing its armed forces and humanity at large. The ensuing conflict, known as the First Bug War, becomes a protracted struggle lasting over five years. The Federation launches an invasion of the arachnid home planet, Klendathu, resulting in a disastrous outcome. The arachnids prove more organized and formidable than anticipated, causing extensive casualties and material losses for the Federation. The defeat forces a retreat, dealing a significant blow to both military capability and morale. Sky Marshal Dean steps back from leadership and Sky Marshal Tehach Muru takes over, recognizing that defeating the arachnids requires more than just military force. Instead, the United Citizen Federation must acquire more knowledge about the extraterrestrial adversaries they are confronting. This understanding is crucial for devising unconventional strategies outside the realm of traditional warfare. A new approach is implemented, involving the capture of a creature known as a brain bug. Johnny is a member of the Roughnecks, a mobile infantry team tasked with landing on Planet P to locate and forcibly remove the brain bug, an arachnid leader commanding the colony's insects. Carl, Johnny's friend and a high-ranking official in military intelligence, emphasizes the importance of capturing the arachnid leader to extract knowledge for developing effective techniques against the arachnids. Johnny and his team successfully capture the brain bug, enabling further study by military intelligence in human-controlled space. The original Starship Troopers film concludes with this event and subsequent developments unfold in sequels and other media. A direct to video sequel titled Starship Troopers, Two Hero of the Federation 2004, continues the franchise, introducing a new storyline on the arachnid world Alpha Zulu. The United Citizen Federation invades, establishing defenses against the alien threat. However, a mobile infantry team, Bravo 6, becomes isolated and faces attacks from arachnids while attempting to hold a stronghold, Hotel Delta 185. Despite using new weaponry and facing a new threat called control bugs, the group awaits rescue, unaware of the impending danger. The control bugs aim to infiltrate Earth's leaders and destabilize the government from within. Captain Dax and Private Sahara, the sole survivors free from control bugs, strive to escape and inform the Federation. Following the events of Starship Troopers 2, an uneasy peace between the United Citizen Federation and the Arachnids ensues, lasting about five years. However, hostilities resume in Starship Troopers 3 Marauder almost a decade after the initial conflicts. Military leaders intensify wartime propaganda, suppressing protests and executing dissenters. The second bug war descends into trench warfare, with neither side gaining an advantage. Colonel Johnny Rico, stationed on the farming planet Roku San, leads a mobile infantry force defending against arachnid invasions. 
Sky Marshal Omanoki's arrival lowers defenses, leading to a horde of warrior bugs overwhelming the troops and forcing humans off the planet. Later, as the intricate web of deception unraveled, the shocking revelation emerged that the sinister orchestrator behind the disabling of the electric perimeter fence was none other than Sky Marshal Omar Anoki. This startling twist in the narrative unfolded in the aftermath of Anoki's unsettling encounter with a captive brain bug from the notorious Starship Troopers events. The insidious influence of the telepathic arachnid gradually permeated Anoki's psyche, compelling him to forsake humanity and clandestinely align himself with the bug forces. Initially cloaked in ambiguity, the act of betrayal cast a shadow over the valiant efforts of Johnny, who had served as a commanding officer during the harrowing mobile infantry overrun on Roku-san. In a cruel twist of fate, Johnny found himself wrongly accused and shouldered with the blame for the treacherous breach. The specter of execution loomed ominously over him, fueled by the misconception of his failure in the line of duty. Unbeknownst to the accusers, Johnny's fate took an unexpected turn as he was covertly spirited away to a highly classified military installation. Within the confines of this clandestine facility, Johnny was thrust into a position of authority as he assumed command of the groundbreaking Marauder program. This experimental initiative was conceived to counter the evolving threat posed by the arachnids. The Marauders, equipped with cutting-edge mech suits known as M11 Baba suits, represented the vanguard of humanity's response. These formidable exoskeletons were designed to endow the soldiers with a decisive advantage against the relentless arachnid menace. Charged with a renewed sense of purpose, Johnny and his elite marauder team embarked on a perilous mission to Ohm-1, the epicenter of the escalating conflict. Their journey, fraught with challenges and perils, epitomized humanity's unyielding resolve to confront and overcome the looming threat posed by the insidious bugs. When the shocking betrayal orchestrated by Sky Marshal Omar Anoki was laid bare, Rico and the formidable marauders descended upon Om-1 with a singular objective, to vanquish the menacing god bug. This colossal creature, reminiscent of an oversized brain bug, posed a formidable threat that demanded the attention and might of the marauder forces. Their mission extended beyond mere confrontation with the god bug. They gallantly undertook the rescue of stranded troops, demonstrating unwavering commitment in the face of imminent peril. As the battle unfolded, the intensity escalated when a substantial human fleet arrived as reinforcement, turning the already tumultuous conflict into a sprawling interstellar showdown. The clash between the marauders and the colossal god bug, accompanied by the arrival of additional human forces, unfolded in a spectacular display of firepower and strategic prowess. The saga persisted and evolved in the subsequent chapter, portrayed in the 2012 animated film Starship Troopers Invasion. Set several years after the harrowing events on Elm One, the narrative pivoted around Johnny Rico's transformation into a seasoned general. However, tranquility remained elusive as a menacing queen bug managed to break free from confinement aboard the formidable ship, John a Warden hurtling towards Earth with ominous intent. In response to this renewed threat, Johnny Rico, now a battle-hardened leader, assumed command once again. He spearheaded a daring mission to intercept and obliterate the approaching ship, thereby averting an impending catastrophe on Earth. The perilous undertaking, however, exacted a heavy toll, resulting in the loss of numerous marauders and valiant members of the mobile infantry. The sacrifices made in the pursuit of safeguarding humanity underscored the gravity of the ongoing struggle against the relentless arachnid menace, leaving an indelible mark on the legacy of Johnny Rico and the stalwart defenders of Earth. In the 2017 film, Starship Troopers Traitor of Mars, Johnny once again faced blame for failing to prevent the John O'Warden and the Queen Bug from landing on Earth. This time, 
he was demoted and reassigned to Mars, where he trained new recruits. Sky Marshal Amy Snap plotted to destroy Mars with a quantum bomb to quell anti-war sentiment and boost popularity. Johnny led an assault against arachnid forces, discovering the hidden quantum bomb. With the help of Carmen and Carl, he stopped the threat, exposing Snap's plan. After the Mars incident, Carl was promoted to Deputy Sky Marshal, and Johnny was reinstated to the rank of General.